hello, hello, hello. Good evening, good evening. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. We can hear you. Okay, okay nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining. Nice. Welcome, thank you for being on time. And this is the last day. How are you, Noemi? Thank you, Yolanda, for your camera. Dagoberto, thank you for joining. We have Crisia right behind the meeting as well. Nice. So, Yolanda, how are you? How was your weekend? Uh, excellent, teacher. My weekend was excellent. Thank you. Okay, perfect. <laughs> did, did you do something uh, special? Uh, only rest. <laughs> okay, that is extremely important, extremely special. You did rest a lot. Okay, perfect. Nice. Perfect. Okay. So let's see, Noemi, how are you? Hi, teacher. Can you hear me clearly? Uh, yeah, I'm a little bit, I know, but probably it's raining most in most of the places. It's raining right now. Yeah, but in this moment, I I am proving uh, helpful. Okay. Okay, no, I mean, no problem. So hopefully we will be able to have the last section today. So I was without electricity, like... 20, in 20 minutes, so I, I was about to put it in the group that I was not with electricity, so that I didn't know how to do that, right? But at the end, so we are fine right now, but it's raining, it's raining. That is something that it's now. So probably in some of your places where you are, probably it is raining as well, okay? But we will see, uh, hopefully we will be able to and right the, the the section that we have for today uh welcome for the ones that are joining let's see dagoberto how are you dagoberto rodriguez good evening teacher fine thanks okay so how was your weekend dagoberto uh it's fine uh, in in the house we we work in the house the weekend Okay, so um, we have the chance to, you know, relax, do like house shorts, different activities, right? Do laundry. And the most important thing, resting, as Yolanda mentioned, right? Be resting <laughs> during the weekend. Nice. Thank you, Dagoberto. Chrissy, how are you, Chrissy? Thank you for your camera. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Thank okay. You. Perfect. And how was your weekend? Did you do um, something interesting? No, I just went to the supermarket with my mom. And yesterday I went to the church. Ah, okay. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Yesterday it's Sunday, right? It was Sunday. So the day four, I uh, got to church, do different activities, uh, eat something, right, with friends, family. Okay, perfect. Now we have Claudia and Bunny. I guess, I don't know if they are here, Claudia, Maria. Today is the last day, right? Today is the last day. Um, so hopefully you were able to finish all the exercise for the platform to complete the 85% as a minimum score. Vanessa, hello, Vanessa. Thank you for your camera. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good I'm evening. fine. Okay. Did you do something important or special during the weekend? Mm, no. Nothing. Nothing special. Nothing. No. Okay. Nothing. Okay, nice. Thank you, Vane. Uh, okay. Claudia Maria. Claudia Maria, I don't know if you are here. Claudia Maria Aviles Estrada. No. 
<laughs> okay. No problem. So let me share the screen. We are going to uh, do different activities today. This is the last day. But what we are going to do is, um, first we are going to review the, we are going to review the, the exam, the last part of the exam. And uh, that is something that we will be able to complete today. So we will see the final quiz. And then we have some activities right here that we will do it together because this is the last day, okay? The idea is that you need to talk, you need to speak, okay? But we will review the final exam first, okay? There are like different um, exercises right here. So we will have to do it one by one, okay? But this is something that we will do like in 15, minutes or less. Okay, so let me check right here. Okay, so this is the, yeah, this is the final quiz. And what we are going to do first is exercise eight. Okay, exercise eight. This is the uh, listening part. Let me check right here, the listening parts. Yeah, I will play the audio just one time and then we will see together the answers, okay? It says, listen to the conversation, then click the correct information, okay? So that's what we are going to do. So let me export this into a different tab. Um, let me double check right here. Okay. Let me know if you can listen. Listen to the conversation. Yes. Yeah, right? Okay, perfect. So listen to the conversation right here. Check the correct information. One. Excuse me, I'm looking for someone. I'm meeting her for lunch here. Her name is Emily Black. All right. What does she look like? Let's see. She's about 25, I guess. Look over there. Is she the one with the long black hair? Oh, uh, no, that's not her. Emily's fairly short and has... Oh, I think I see her. Look, she's waving at you. Two. Sarah, did you hear that Judy has a new boyfriend? No, I didn't. Listen What's to the like? conversations. Well, his name's Ch Steve, and he's very nice. And he's tall. Real All right, let, let's see the first one, okay? And that way we will be able to do it together. So welcome, Elvis, to the meeting. So please, I don't know if you were able to listen to the conversation about the, the number one. What is, Alisa, I guess that is the question number one. What is the answer for you, Elvis? Uh, sorry, I didn't. Uh, okay, okay, so uh, you came a little go, bit late. Go to the website. Okay. Yes, but I finished. Okay, perfect. So what about you, Yolanda? What is the question, the, the answer for number one? based on the listening part. Okay. Uh, Emily is fairly short and about 25. Okay, Emily is fairly short in about eight and about 25, right? Okay, so let's see. Let's see one more time right here. Thank you. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct information. Check the correct information. One. Excuse me, I'm looking for someone. I'm meeting her for lunch here. Her name is Emily Black. All right. What does she look like? Let's see. She's about 25, I guess. Look over there. Is she the one with the long black hair? Oh, uh, no, that's not her. Emily's fairly short and has... I think I see her. 
Look, she's waving at you. Two. Sarah, did you hear that Judy has a new boyfriend? No, I didn't. What's he like? Well, his name's Steve, and he's very nice. And he's tall, really tall. He's over six feet tall. What color is his hair? His hair is blonde and curly. He sounds very handsome. He is, and he's the same age as Judy. So he's only 19? Yes, that's right. Okay, so let's see, number two, Vanessa. What will be the answer for number two? The answer is, is, is really tall and has blonde hair. Okay, perfect. Let's continue with the next one. Three. All right, Mr. Brown. Tell me again what happened here. Thank you, officer. I told you, the man took my wife's purse from the back of her chair. We were at this table. What did the thief look like? I told you, he was elderly. He was maybe in his 70s. And about how tall was he? You mean how short was he? He was short, only about five feet tall. What else do you remember? Well, he had on baggy pants and a red t-shirt. He also had a white beard. Okay, uh, Cesar, number three, what will be the answer for you, Cesar? The thief was sure had a white beard. That was early. Okay, thank you. Let's see the next one. Four. What else do you remember? Well, he had on baggy pants and a red t-shirt. He also had a white beard. Four. Hi, I'm new here. My name's Sharon. I'm Charlie. Welcome to our school party. Do you want something to eat? Not right now, thanks. Actually, I'm looking for AJ and Penny. I need their phone number. Which ones are they? They're that good-looking couple sitting on the couch. Oh, I see them, thanks. And one more thing. Is Clara here? I need to ask her a question about her homework for tomorrow. Let me see. Oh, yes, I see her. She's wearing jeans and a red sweater. She's standing over there talking to Tom. Okay. Nice. Uh, let's see. Grecia Munoz, what would be the answer for number four? Is a a G and Penny are the attractive couple sitting on the couch? Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. Let me select this one and let me submit the answers. Okay. And yes, we get it all. Number one, two, three, and four. Perfect. So let's move on to the next. Uh, exercise. This is complete the conversation. Instructions complete the conversation. Use the present perfect of the birds given in brackets. Okay. Uh, Florence, what will be number one? Have you been? B E E B E E N. Perfect. Have you been to any movie lately? Nice. Luis Alonso, number two. Uh, yes, uh, I have already a uh, seen mm -hmm. three films. I already, yes, I already see mm. fields. In that case, mm. how will be the bird? Spell the, the, the bird, please. 
F E E N. Is this one C? F E E N. C N, right? Yes. Okay. Claudia Maria, welcome. Claudia, nice to see you again. Claudia Maria, number three. In, in. Oh, my goodness, sorry. Seeing, okay, seeing the field this month. Nice. Claudia Maria, number two, letter eight. Has, has he ever eaten the Thai food before? Okay, perfect. Has he ever eaten Thai food before? Okay. And the answer, let's see, Noemi Yesenia. No, he has never had it in his life. Okay, no, he has never had, had in his life. Okay, and then we have another instruction right here. Read the sentences and choose the correct answer. Okay. So let's see, we have right here. My goodness, you don't, I don't see your cameras. Dagoberto, Dagoberto, number one, please read the sentence. Dagoberto, you are on mute. Thank for, you. I live in Boston for five years. I love every minute I was there. Okay, I live in Boston for five years. Nice. Elvis Abrego, number two. Yeah. Hmm? Elvis, you are on mute, Elvis. There. Sorry, sorry, teacher. My wife and I have gone to Costa Rica every, every year since 2001. Okay, perfect. And the last one, the last one will be for Luis Alonso. Uh, Patrick has study, studied Portuguese um, for a long time. He's a good speaker now. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Luis. Let's submit the answer. Saying we got it all nice. Perfect. Let's move on to the le, uh, almost the last one. Let us see. Choose the correct answer. Read the following sentences and choose the correct word. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, Rafael, number one, please read the complete sentence. My brother is in his 20s and goes to college in Arizona. Okay, my brother is in his 20s and goes to college in California. Nice. Um, mm -hmm. Thank you. Let's see the next Se cambió one. De escuela. Okay, let's see, let's see. Marina. Marina Sanabria. I don't see your camera, but I guess you are there. So number two. Thank you. <laughs> Tracy has short, straight black hair and blue eyes. Perfect. Sure. Uh, Tracy has short, straight black hair and blue eyes. Thank you. Ada Gabriela. Ada Gabriela. Number three. Hello. Hello, hello, go ahead. Number three. Phil's nephew has. Mm -hmm. Has five feet eight and has dark brown beard and mustache. Okay, Phil's nephew has five feet eight and has dark brown beard and mustache. Okay, 
Nice. Uh, let's continue with Florence, number four. Has Martin ever ever missed an appointment? Okay, perfect. Has Marine ever missed an appointment? Nice. Uh, Caesar, number five, please. Um, excuse me, uh, how many times have you lost your cell phone? Okay, how many times have you lost your cell phone? Number six, that will be for, let's see. My goodness, I don't see your cameras. Milagro, Milagro, mira, number six. Have you ever drunk a truck? Have you ever drunk, drunk a truck? Okay, nice. Oh my goodness, uh -huh. we have two negatives. Let's see, Tracy. Okay, Tracy, okay, and this one, have you ever ride, driving? Driving. Okay, yeah, that was the correct one, and this one is ease, feel, nest, feel, ease. Okay, and this one, my goodness, does. Tracy, does. Does. No, it's teacher. Has, teacher. Has, 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 has. We put it in that way, it was negative. Si la habíamos puesto así, I don't know why lo dio negativo. Mm -hmm. Porque we have it does. I don't know, but it's that one. It's that one has. Okay. So now we have it. Okay. So let's finish with the last part. Okay. We finish with this uh, a scrambled sentence. What is a mm -hmm. scramble? What mm -hmm. is the. What is the meaning of this word in scramble? Scramble. Mm -hmm. Ordenar. Ordenar, right? Rewrite and scramble the sentence, okay? So put the words in the correct order to make sentences or questions, okay? So let's do it at orally. Lo vamos a hacer así más rapidito. Andrea Sosa, number one, we have is, gorgeous, that is um, uh, Christy hair really in. What would be the correct sentence? Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, Christy uh, is in her 30s and really gorgeous. Okay, Christy. Christy is. Christy is in her 30 Okay, in her uh, terrace and and really gorgeous. And really gorgeous. Okay, what is gorgeous? What is the meaning of this? Fabuloso, fabuloso, espectacular, oh. right? So even though she is in her terrace. Okay, nice. Um, let's see, Clicia Muñoz, number two. We have a wear, mustache, have, sand, a dust, glasses, and. I'm not clue about this. Uh, this is the only exercise <laughs> that I. <laughs> that we have issues. Yeah, I know that this was kind of complicated, but let's see together, okay? Claudia Maria, what do you think okay. about number two? Somewhere. Claudia Maria. Mm -hmm. uh, number two, does, some. does Sam have a mustache some. and wear yeah. glasses? Yeah. Okay. Sam, uh, let's see, Sam. Some. Does Sam have 
So that was a question. This is a question. question. Right? Does, does Glenn, does Sam, Sam wear glasses and have a mustache? And wear a mustache, okay? That would be, okay? Sam does wear uh, glasses and have a mustache, okay? Mm -hmm. That would be, uh, I didn't realize that it was a question, but yeah, we have the question mark right here. Okay, uh, let's see, Luis Alonso, the next one, red, Cindy, height, long, has, and is medium hair. Luis Cindy. Alonso. Mm -hmm. Cindy has, long, has, long hair. Mm -hmm. Cindy, Cindy has long hair. Has. Mm -hmm. What would be the order for this Cindy one? Has Cindy, has, um, has Cindy has. Cindy has long red hair. Ah, okay. Cindy is medium height. Okay. And has long red hair. Okay, long red hair. Nice. And the last one, Rafael. On um, person next to Jason Cup, who's sitting there. This is a question. Let me see. The, who's the person? Espérate, mi amor. Sitting. Espérate. Next to, J to Jason on the couch. Okay. Okay. Who's the person sitting next to J Jason on the couch? Okay. Let's see, let's see. Well, my goodness, let me show the answers right here. Okay, who's the person sorry, sitting on sorry, the coach? Hola? Sorry, could you repeat the number four? Yes, number four, we have two positive answers. Who's the person sitting on the coach next to Jason? Or who's the person sitting next to J Jason? on the coach okay so this mm -hmm. is a question okay this is a question it doesn't show the question mark right here but it, it is a question cindy has long i'm sorry cindy has long red hair and is medium high or cindy is medium high and has long red hair does sam wear glasses and have a mustache that sam have a mustache and wear glasses and uh, christy is really gorgeous and in her teddies or Christy is in her teddies and really gorgeous. Okay, oh, perfect. So we have finished. Okay, we have finished. We have my goodness, 30 minutes. My goodness for the reading. Well, so let's read together. Okay, uh, let's see who. Uh, Yolanda, please help us with the reading. Read the whole paragraph. I don't know if you're able to see it. Let me see if I can make it bigger. No, it's okay, okay. for me. Perfect, Hi. thank you. <laughs> Hi, Nina. Guess, guess what? I moved into my new apartment yesterday. I really like my new roommate. I also like the neighborhood. There are a lot of, uh, there are a lot of different restaurants here. Last night, I ate at a Vietnamese restaurant just around the corner. The food was delicious, and I want to try a new Brazilian restaurant near here. For breakfast this morning, I came to this great coffee shop across from my apartment. Actually, it's an internet cafe, so I am emailing, you know, uh, all paragraph, teacher. Let's go ahead. It's a really convenient neighborhood. There is a laundromat on our street and there are some interesting stores too. One store uh, sells lots of amazing CDs, DVDs, and books from all over the world. And my roommates 
told me there's a dance club, club just two blocks away. I want to go dancing every weekend. Come visit, Sarah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sorry, Kim. it's raining really hard right here, okay? But let's see. Okay, so this one was the one that a lot of people was confusing, right? Because of the answer. So let's see, uh, which ones are the ones? Sarah, Kim, read books? Yes or no? No. Not really. Eat Venezuelan food? No. No. Exercise at the gym? No. No. Get a haircut? No. No. Go dancing? Yes. 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 Okay, go shopping? Yes. 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 Perfect. Make a travel arrangement? No. 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 See movies? Yes. No. 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 Send no. emails? Yes. 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 Okay, this one and wash and dry clothes? Yes. yes. Okay, let's see. Yay, we have all the answers. Okay, perfect. We finished. Okay, with this, we finished the five parts in the uh, quiz. Okay, so let's continue what we have right here. So now I guess that we are more in the meeting. Let's see, we are a team. Nice. Look, look at this picture. Remember, this is the last day. Today is the last day. And what we are going to do is, you know, different activities for you to practice your English, okay? That's the idea that you need to speak, okay? So look at the picture that we have right here. We have different uh, people right there. We have the names and they are doing something, okay? So what you are going to do is you are going to ask questions to your classmates about the people that you are able to see. For example, if I say, uh, let's see, if I say to Dagoberto, Dagoberto Rodriguez, okay? If I say, uh, what is uh, Jory? What is Jory doing right now? Uh, Dagoberto, what is Jory doing right now? Aha, uh -huh, Dagoberto, look at the pictures, look at the names, Yari. Uh, please repeat. Yeah, what is Yari doing right now based on the picture, okay? Based on oh. the picture, what is she she's doing? Dancing. Ah, she, she's okay. dancing. Okay, she's dancing. What kind of music do you think that she's dancing? Time, uh... <laughs> uh, pop music <laughs> pop music okay how old do you think that she can be uh, repeat please how old do you think that she can be uh, no I don't understand how old is she? How old is uh, uh, Jari? Uh, uh, what do you think, right? Because we don't know, uh, but we can imagine, we can suppose. He's in her 20. Okay, probably she's really young. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Dagoberto. Let's see, uh, Cesar. Cesar, let's see. Um, what is Helen uh, doing? Uh, Cesar, what is Helen doing? Uh, Helen has a pizza. Uh, mm -hmm. Helen is, is 25 years old. No, listen, listen to the question. What is Helen doing? Okay, you got this. Uh, your face, ovals, oval face. Mm -hmm. No, but Caesar, listen to the question. What is Helen doing right now based on the picture, right? What is she doing right now? Uh, ask what, uh, what is they doing? What do you mean they doing? Do? Doing, I-N-G, present continuous. A cheese items. Uh-huh. What does 
uh, what what does a she or what is a she eating right now? Okay. What do you think that she is eating right now? Yellow earrings. No, no. What is she eating? Based on the picture, look at the picture. Helen, what is she eating? <laughs> uh huh, sister. I don't understand. I don't understand the question. What is she eating? Probably pizza. Está comiendo. Mm -hmm. She is eating pizza. Do you think it's pizza? I don't know what it is. So probably there are some snacks. I don't know, like, you know. Oh. Like churritos. It's a, it's right? a big churrito. A nacho. A big That's... nacho. Okay, a big nacho. <laughs> okay, nice. Sure, Let's sure, see. Sure. Let's see, Rafael, Rafael, what is uh, Tom doing in the base on the picture? What is he doing, Tom? He's singing. He's singing. Ah, okay. What music or what sound do you think that he's singing? I think <laughs> he's singing um, pop, pop music. <laughs> pop music, okay. Rock. So... And how, or probably rock, right? He's wearing a black shirt. Right. Okay. And uh, how old do you think that he is? I think he's 28 years old. Oh, okay. He is 28. Do you think, uh, can you describe a little bit uh, more about him? Like, what does he look like? Yes. Uh... He wear a black shirt and green pants. He he use a uh, lentes. Uh -huh. How do you say lentes? Uh, glasses. <laughs> glasses. <laughs> yes. Okay. Sunglasses in this case, no. The sunglasses. Yes. Sunglasses. Okay. Sunglasses. Uh, okay. He has a big. Teeth. Okay, he has a big teeth. Okay. Okay, perfect, Rafael. Yolanda, Yolanda, what about uh, Sam? Yolanda, what is Sam uh, doing? Uh, he's drinking uh, Coke. Coke? And how uh, probably he's drinking something else. What do you think that he's drinking? Why you say uh, Coke? <laughs> maybe vodka. <laughs> okay, probably. They, they maybe. Look, probably because they look like if they are in a party, right? So Jesus. probably they are drinking, I don't know, vodka. But they are young people. Ah, okay. Yeah, they look <laughs> really young. Maybe Sonic <laughs> Yeah, probably it's just a refresh or something, right? Yes. Okay, and what do you think that he's talking about what because he looks like if he's talking with Danny. What do you okay. think that is the topic about? I think uh, they are talk about uh, the exam. Uh, this is the last party for the year. And uh -huh. he's very worried because uh, maybe he doesn't pass the exam. <laughs> okay, perfect. Nice imagination. This is like the last <laughs> day of, of uh, school, right? Like, like I don't know, like the last day and they are in a party celebrating, but it's kind of worry. Okay, probably about the exam. Okay, nice. Okay, uh, let's see. Vamos a ver quién más. No hemos preguntado. Vanessa. Vanessa, what about Jason? What is Jason doing? What do you think, Bane? Uh, I think Jason... <laughs> Jason does... Talk with Claire. 
about Tom or about uh, Dave mm -hmm. or about the music or the lights mm -hmm. or I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Remember, in this case, um, the, the, the questions that I'm doing uh, are like in present continuous, right? Did you remember the present okay. continuous? That's the famous ING, right? The present continuous is the famous ING form. So in that case, we need to put the verse in ING. And uh, we have, for example, Jason, probably I see that he's like pointing. Okay, he's pointing tone or probably he's pointing, I don't know, the lights that we have right here. So he's pointing. We need to use the verse with the ING. Okay, or probably he is laughing. Look at the picture right here. Probably he's laughing about Tom because probably Tom sings horrible, right? Terrible, and he's like laughing about ha ha ha, right? So he can sing, but let's see. Remember that Yolanda mentioned that probably they are in a party, right? We don't know. Probably they are in a party, so they are celebrating something. Okay, so uh, let's see. The next question will be for Claudia, Claudia Maria. Uh, what about, let's see, uh, Lucy. What is uh, Lucy uh, doing? Lucy's dancing alone. Oh. <laughs> okay, she's dancing alone. Okay, yeah. and why do you think that she's dancing alone? And most of them, they are in pair, right? They are like in couple, but she's alone. Why do you think? Um, I don't know, because they prefer to stay with Judy. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and then Lucy is dancing alone because he likes dance. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So probably they prefer to dance with Jody instead of dance with Lucy. Okay, and let's see, Claudia, how uh, Lucy look like. Um, Lucy is wearing a pant, a blue pant, mm -hmm. and orange blouse. And he, she, sorry, she is um, I don't know how do you say. Uh, hat, gorro. Okay, she's wearing a hat. Wearing a hat. Okay, okay, and for also she has like curly brown hair, right? Brown and curly hair. Okay, nice. Well, we have more people here, but because of the time, we have to continue with the next part that we have right here, and this is a. Uh, different cards okay for us to talk okay so but we will let's we will see if we have time for this okay because the idea is do breakout rooms and you can move on to a different room and start choosing and ask those questions to your classmates but let's let me let me see okay let me see if we can uh do something else right here and then we can continue with the final activity okay so just let me open really quick right here this link because we have some games right here okay and remember that we are done we already covered the final exam and this is just the last activity that we have okay so let me let me right here find it okay so remember that we were um talking about the Present perfect, right? Present perfect. So we have some examples right here about the um, past participles of the birds and the present 
perfect, okay? So we will see, let's see when this one, this one, this one, just yet and already. This is something that we mentioned in the class, okay? So these ones are like games, okay? Remember that this is the last day and the idea is just practice everything, okay? So this is present perfect. Okay, let me make it bigger. Okay, here it is. So Andrea Sosa, okay? So read the question and tell us what will be the correct answer for this sentence. This is present perfect. Andrea? Oh, sorry. Um, I, uh, that a ride home for, from work? Okay, I have a I have ready, I'm ready, okay? E, uh, it says in the red, okay? So the red one is just. I just a ride home from work. Milagro, mira, number two. We have one minute, my goodness. Okay, so read the sentence with the answer. You are on mute, Milagro. We will get seen to the movie twist. Okay, we have Jet seen the movie twice, twice, twice. Well, are you sure yet, Milagro? Yes. It says incorrect, okay? <laughs> so the correct one already, we have already seen the movie in twice. Es como que yo le diga, ya hemos visto esta película dos veces, okay? Let's okay. see, Elvis, read the question, please. Has your mother opened her present? Uh, yep. Jet, okay, has your mother opened her presents, Jet? Okay, that's the correct one, okay? Let's see the next one, Luis Alonso. He uh -huh. is just turned on the TV. Okay, he uh, just turned on the TV, okay? Yes, that's the one. Dagoberto, the next one is for you, Dagoberto. You are on mute, Dagoberto. You is... Uh, I haven't had breakfast yet. Okay, I haven't had breakfast yet. Nice. And uh, let's see, the next one, Noemi Jesenia. We share. You are on mute, Noemi. Sorry. Richard just phoned me three times today. Okay, Richards just found me three times today. Hmm, ready. Okay, my goodness, we have three out of six, okay? My goodness, okay, well, we have to practice a little bit more. Let's see, we have a different activity right here, okay? So this one, present perfect spin. So be ready to talk. Remember that idea is that you need to talk. You need to talk. Okay, this is a present perfect, okay? We have different sentences right here and you have to complete it, okay? You have to complete the sentence, okay? 
So Yolanda, this, this question will be for you. It's not like a question, it's like a phrase, but you have to complete the phrase, okay? So let's see Yolanda, this will be for you. But I need to put together a no, nah. uh, you, you no. need to complete ah, the, the complete. sentence. Okay. Uh -huh. I I uh, present perfect. I was a child. I I, I don't know. I uh, learn learn since I was a child. Uh -huh. But that would be Oh, simple past, right? So no, I have I, been, ah, I okay. learned ah, since okay. I was since a child. I was a child. Okay. Uh -huh. Learn. Uh, perfect. Okay. So let's eliminate this one and we have one more. Okay. Let's see. This one will be for uh Florence. Okay, let's see Florence. Okay, Florence, try to complete the idea right there. I have seen la 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 la. I have seen a movie yesterday. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. I have seen a movie. Mm. Remember, Do press, uh huh. The present perfect is it's an action uh, that is starting the past, uh, but it still is in the present. Still, okay, I have mm -hmm. seen the class. Okay, okay. I, I have seen yeah. the class seems last year as an example, right? Remember that I have seen the class since last year. So yo he estado viendo la clase desde el año pasado as an example, right? So that's the idea, okay? Present perfect, okay? So let's see the next one. The next one will be for Rosario del Carmen. Be ready, Rosario. Yeah. Okay, Rosario, my best friend has. Um, has been her wife. Mm -hmm. But the, the, the first part says my best friend has been. Uh -huh. been. Being? Being? Being in New York. Okay, my best friend has been in New York seems he was a child, for example, right? Remember that we need to complete the, the sentence, right? To make sense, okay? My best friend has been um uh, in New York for 20 years, okay? Desde hace 20 años hasta hoy está, yeah, okay? Nice, okay? So let's see one more. This one will be for Caesar. Caesar, Caesar, be ready. Yay. This is a nice, since the quarantine period start. Uh-huh, Caesar. Something in the past until now, present perfect since the quarantine period start. Mm. 
I work since uh, since the quarantine period start. One more time, I'm sorry. I work since the quarantine period start. Mm -hmm. But present okay. perfect, present perfect. I have been working since the quarantine period start. So he estado trabajando desde que la cuarentena empezó, right? So that will be the, the way. So let's see the last one, the last, the last one for this exercise. Oh my goodness, we have four minutes only. Christia, Christia, this is for you. Okay, I have watched. I have watched um, um, that video. Okay, I have watched, watched it. This is my and baby, look. <laughs> oh, it's so I'm in class, baby. So, uh huh. I have watched. Uh, I have watched. Watch the movie. That video. Uh huh. I have watched the same video mm -hmm. in twice as an example, right? So, yo he visto este, he estado viendo este video en dos ocasiones or more. Okay, mm -hmm. so my goodness, time is flying. We have one more. Okay, just let me complete the last one. Okay, so this one is about the birds. Okay, what is the past simple of take? So let's see. Vamos a ver si se aprendieron los verbos. Okay, <laughs> let me see right here. Okay, vamos a ver. Ajá, let's see, let's see. Yolanda, read the question. I can see the question, teacher. What's the past simple of it? Eight. Okay. Eight. Yay! Vanessa, let's see the next one, Bane. Um, what's the past symbol of take? Take. Take. Mm -hmm. Take. <laughs> Los verbos, niños. Ahí les mandé una listita. <laughs> take. Which one? Remember. <laughs> Took. Took. Okay. Yay. Ajá. Uh -huh, nice. Okay. Uh, Dagoberto. Dagoberto. Ajá. Uh -huh. The question. Maybe. 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 The past participle of make. Made. Uh -huh. Past participle. Made. Made. Yay. Claudia. The next one. Claudia Maria. Where's, what's the past simple of B? Was or where? Was or where? Well, where? Where and being. I don't know what happened with that one. No, no sé qué pasó. But the one, the one was where, right? The past of B wasn't where depending on the subject. Okay, Cesar, this is for you. Bow. Bow. What is the past participle of bite? C, bow. Bow. Letter D? And C. Letter C? Yes, yes, that's the one, okay? Let's see, Noemi, Yesenia. 
B. What's the past participle of B? B. Letter B. B. Letter B. Nice. Okay, perfect. What is the Elvis? The next one, Elvis. Elvis, Elvis. Three. Yes. Three. What the was the what the past the participle past? of the real? Yeah. Real. A, B, C, or D? Um, uh, Elvis? Both. Um, uh, but uh, C. Letter, letter C. C. Mm -hmm. No. Read. Okay. Past yeah. participle, right? Past participle. Nice. Uh, Luis Alonso, the next uh -huh. one. Luis Alonso? Uh -huh. Read the question, please. Luis Alonso, Luis Alonso, can you hear? Uh, okay. uh -huh. Luis C, Alonso, letter, letter C. C. Okay, what is the past participle of get? Gotten. No. Okay, it's got. Okay. Yeah. My goodness. Yeah. Morimos, niños, morimos. Sí, chers, ah, chers. Ay, no. eh, the past participle is got, got, gotten, it's gotten, no? Yeah, yeah, I don't ah, know why. Vale. I, I, even the last, the, the, yes. the other one, what it says where, lo tiró malo, vale. pero I don't know why. Mm. Okay, y nos mató, mire, has muerto. My goodness, so we die. <laughs> well, so we finished class. I'm sorry, okay, I'm taking like two more minutes from the class, but I would like to take a couple of pictures as well from the from the the group. Okay, let me take a hold your cameras, please. This is the last date. Les voy a mandar las fotitos ahí al, al grupo del WhatsApp para que se acuerden cuando estuvimos aquí, ya cuando estén allá en el nivel avanzado, se acuerden de los intermedios, ok, so, ahí pónganse los colochos, ok, ¿qué se me hizo Rafael? No lo veo ya Rafael, se salió de la meeting, Ada, Gabriela, Rosario, Lisette, falta su cámara, voy a tomar un par de screenshots aquí, Y vamos a tomar un par de imágenes también. Déjeme ver que se sale bien acá. Whisky, teacher. Digan whisky, digan, vamos a ver con este otro filtro de cámara, retrato. Está abierto, se mira un poco oscuro. Pero ahí está bien. Yay, nice. So I will share it with you in the in the WhatsApp group, okay? So okay. thank you. I really appreciate it. And I know that I was not with you since the very first date. But at the end, so two weeks we were together. So I really enjoyed to be with you. And I hope that you will be able to continue, okay? So remember you. that in your learning process, it doesn't matter who is your teacher. The important thing is that you are learning, right? And no matter what, you continue with your classes, improving your English. And so I hope that you will continue, okay? It was a big pleasure for me. And thank you that uh, at the end, just for the two last week, you were able to share with me everything and were able to participate in the classes, right? So les deseo lo mejor, que sigan adelante. Un gusto haber estado con ustedes dos semanitas y agradecerles, ¿verdad? Por todo el, el tiempo y, y, y la, la comprensión ahí del cambio de maestro, right? Pero como les digo, no importa el maestro, sino el aprendizaje que cada uno de ustedes van haciendo día con día. Así que un gusto. Cualquier cosa, pues ahí tienen mi número. Si en algún día necesitan algo, dinero, no, no me vayan a pedir. Pero si algún día necesitan. 
ayuda en algo, pues con gusto me pueden escribir. Me dice, mire, teacher, yo soy fulanito de, ¿se acuerda? De la clase de intermedio. Ahí me voy a acordar de ustedes. ¿Ok? Los que pusieron las cámaras, créanme que me voy a acordar de ustedes. Los que no me ponían la cámara, eh, me, difícilmente me voy a acordar del rostro, pero voy a saber que es de acá, ¿verdad? Así es que gracias y, y un gusto. Espero verlos más adelante. Si Dios lo permite, un otro módulo más adelante. Primero Dios. Teacher. Thank you, teacher. Y no Gracias, se le, bendiciones. Y no se puede Thank pedir you. que usted esté en el próximo. Fíjese que honestamente es bien difícil porque ellos llevan como una, una agenda, pues. Entonces ellos van viendo cómo acomodan a todos los grupos. Entonces, eh, bien difícil. Yo quisiera decirle que sí, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Pero eso pues no... No está en mis manos. Ellos uh -huh. nada más le mandan la candela, cande, my goodness, calendarización. Ok, ya, yeah, eso. So, Gracias a usted por la paciencia también y pues realmente hemos aprendido mucho con usted. Qué bueno, qué usted? bueno. Y lo que yo les puedo aconsejar es que eh, no pierdan el, el, el hablar porque algunos es, siento que les da un poquito de pena todavía, pero... A este nivel intermedio ya usted tiene que ir hablando y lo que lo que sea que el maestro le pregunte o aunque no le pregunte, usted debe de saltar y decir yo, yo, yo voy a participar porque eso sí tiene usted que el speaking. Ustedes pueden saber mucha gramática, ya ¿Cómo? mucha escritura, pero si no hablamos ahí nos estamos quedando cortos. Así que hay yo, que yo. hablar y hablar y hablar para que practiquen lo, lo que han aprendido. Ok. Thank you. Thank you. Mucho Thank you. gusto, gracias. Gracias. Gracias, gracias mucho gusto. Gracias, Salir tú, mi niño. Mira, sí, en la video. No, mi niño, tú no.